Get ready to vote. Step 1. Registration. Check to see if your state requires registration and find out what the deadline is. If you are already registered to vote, maybe you need to update some of your registration information. Step 2. ID. It's important to have your identification with you when you go vote. If you don't have an ID, some states offer a free non-driver ID card, especially for people that need them to vote. Step 3. Polling places. Find out your polling location and what the voting hours are for that place. If you're in line before the polls close, you do have a right to vote. Keep your spot in line and don't leave until you have cast your ballot. Next, figure out how you are going to get to the polling place, whether it's using public transportation or getting help from your friends and family. If you need particular accommodations because of your certain disability, you should call the precinct ahead of time and request those. Step four, support. You can bring someone to assist you in the voting process. There usually are people at the polling place that can help you if you don't have anybody to go with you. They do have to accommodate you. For more info, visit your Secretary of State or County Elections website.